ahorita que está caliente. No voy a comer a la carne. ¿Una limonada o querés fresco de manzana? Fresco de manzana, dame. Pero no te le pongo yo. Ah, couples are incapable of raising a child then i would have something to fall back on so something to take all the pressure off of me yes it is i made it i decorated it well you might have uh, hang on i want to see my egg huh i want to see my egg wendy it isn't your egg anymore yes it is i made it i decorated it well you might have made it but we're the ones who are taking care of it now you have your own egg to look out for Same-sex couples from all over the state have shown up in support, while dissenters have also converged. 
The governor is about to give a statement. I believe that I might have come up with a compromise to this whole problem that will make everyone happy. People in the gay community want the same rights as married couples, but dissenters don't want the word marriage corrupted. So how about we let gay people get married, but call it something else? You homosexuals will have all the exact same rights as married couples. But instead of referring to you as married, you can be butt buddies. Instead of being man and wife, you'll be butt buddies. You won't be betrothed, you'll be butt bodies. Get it? Instead of a bride and groom, you'd be butt buddies. We want to be treated equally. You are equal. It's just that instead of getting engaged, you would be butt bodies. And everyone is happy. Well, what about lesbians? Well, like anyone cares about fucking dykes. Oh, God, I was scared that was Damn it, damn it. Stan and Kyle's egg is still doing fine. Those little assholes are screwing up my whole plan. Yes, what? What the hell is this? I broke the egg. You broke your egg? But, but you're partnered with a girl. I tried to cover it up. Tried to put it back together with bottom glue. Tried to seal it with a soldering gun, but I give up. I can't hide it. I broke the egg. Did you tell anyone else about this? No. Did you tell your egg partner, Heidi? No. That's why I'm here. I think you should still give Heidi an A on the project. You see, I broke the egg, not her. And so I should get an F and she should get an A. Which means that together, the grade should average out to a C- minus for both of us. I can't do that, Eric. Damn it. I knew you'd say that. You always have it out for me. You have to get an A, Eric. Here, I'll sign this new egg for you. And we'll pretend this never happened, all right? Just put on the old hair, color in the same eyes. There we go. Good as new. Now go enjoy the rest of your recess. Mr. Gerson, you've never been this cool to me before. Okay, well, you're welcome, Eric. Now, just run along. Why are you doing this? Because I'm a nice teacher, all right? What do you want from me? Nothing! It's all okay! Just take your damn egg! No. Eric, you've never been anything but a problem for me. You're taking that egg. And if you break it again, I'll break both your legs and burn down your house! Do you hear me? Yes, PJ. Get out of my face! Ugh, this scientific study isn't turning out the way I planned. Looks like I'm going to have to intervene. Are you Jakartha? Who the hell are you? Mrs. Garrison. I spoke to your associates on the telephone. Ah, uh, yes. You are interested in my services. I have a little problem I need taken care of. I heard you're the best. Who do you want me to kill? What is this? It's an egg. You want me to kill an egg? I can pay 2000 now. Three more when the job is finished. What do you expect me to do with it? I don't care. Scramble it, fry it, do what you will. Mm -hmm. You what? It has to look like an accident. I am a serious assassin. Get out of my face. What's the matter? You afraid you can't do it? Can't say that I blame you. That egg has caused me nothing but problems since day one. I guess you're not as good as they say you are. I am the greatest killer the world has ever seen. Then why are you scared of one little egg? I will murder that egg, and I will make it cut the day it was laid. That's more like it.
going to take this safety class myself. And I'm going to hold it up in front of Wendy and say, see, I'm every bit as good as Kyle is. in this decision. A new study? Here with the results of that study is the lovely Mrs. Garrison. Thank you, Governor. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ladies and gentlemen, with the help of some adorable fourth grade students, we've completed our scientific, non-biased study of bags having kids. Come on up, children. The parents were grouped together as male and female. As you can see... Uh, Mrs. Garrison. You have an emergency phone call. Yes, what is it? I'm a little busy. Kyle, our egg is okay. We'll be there in a couple of minutes. What? You're... You're too late. Don't fail us. We'll be right there. No, you can't. Hello? Hello? You told me to kill that freak guy. I was good, I did. Well, it's here. You better make damn sure it doesn't reach these snaps on crack. <laughs> Anyhow, as I was saying, we put one egg into the hands of two... Male students. Hey, dude, get over there. Excuse us, excuse us, please. I now pronounce you 